Hi guys, welcome to Code Igniter Admin Template. Okay, so the purpose of this uh, video is to teach you how you can set up the, the free uh, template you are going to download from online. Okay, so if you have you know, downloaded the software either from GitHub or SourceCodesta or SourceForge.net, okay, so you need to watch this video so that you can know exactly how to get the sql file because this is very important before you can actually you know successfully set up the the freight template okay so actually guys you are going to get everything all the source code no limitation or restrictions okay you can use the software to build any web application okay actually we have used the same uh, a template okay that we are giving you free of charge to develop a complete a school management system okay and we have the cause uh, up here the name okay so that is to tell you that we are giving you a powerful packed uh, a template that you can use to build in the web uh, application okay so if you want to develop a student management system a school management system or third management system this template is very beautiful responsive you know different from other template online okay so you can use it to build awesome uh, software okay so let me show you uh, uh, uh but actually before i i show you uh, how to download the sql uh, a file okay uh for the purpose of setting up the this a uh, 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 template of uh, this software okay and uh, don't forget that the template has uh, a complete rule based uh, system okay so you can have a new user okay and at the same time you can assign rules for uh, such a uh, users okay so if you want to build a complete he happy software okay this is the good starting point you don't need to write a login codes you don't need to write a course that we you know, register your user okay so uh, everything has been uh, pre-written for you okay for you to use to build your application okay because in the software the login code is very secure and it's very standard okay you can register a new user and at the same time you can assign a role okay for the uh, user okay guys before showing you the how to download the sql file okay i want to show you something okay uh the this is our uh, Udemy cross. This is how the template looks like. Can you see that? Okay. So this uh, is a course. This is one of our courses on Udemy. Build complete a uh, cool system using PHP code igniter framework. Okay. And we got a lot of things. Okay. Can you see that? Uh, about uh, almost 500 uh, lectures okay and almost 55 hours a uh, video okay actually we are still having more courses okay uh to this uh, tutorial because we are you know working with biometric system we are building a school management system you know, that you uh be able to you know integrate a biometric system to this software in case you want to mark an offender we have worked with a lot of apis okay click a form apis ajano api so many payment api paytm i know paypal uh, uh paystack a uh, virgo pay extra module a lot of paper you are going to learn a lot of things here okay uh from this course at udemy can you see that a lot of sections there and look at the red thing can you see the red thing can you see the red thing so this is to tell you that if you enroll uh to this course you are going to learn a lot of things there can you see the, can you see that uh guys can you can you see that okay look at the look at the comment we have a very a beautiful comment. if i click on uh viewer okay ah uh, you uh, you are gonna learn a lot of things there okay so guys are uh, back to uh their uh their course okay back to the template i have to set up the template for you okay guys uh don't forget that you need to download a server to your system okay you are going to download a server it could be one server it could be exam it could be lamp it could be map okay so just make sure you have installed the one server or exam or any local server that you can successfully run your php application or on, 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 on okay so in my case i have used uh a warm server okay and if you don't have in the server on your system uh just go to google.com okay 
uh, uh, just search for one server or exam, okay? Then you press error, okay? Then you, you, you are going to see the official website there. Just go to the either one server or exam official website, okay? And download the server, okay? Just normal installation. I should not be teaching you how to install a uh, uh, software at, at this point, okay? So just make sure you download the server from the official website, okay? And install on your system, either Mac or, or Windows, okay? So when you have the server on your system, okay, uh, for example, if you are using a uh, one server like my own case, you should see something like this. And these are the software I've actually, you know, developed, okay, uh, that I have on this uh, server, okay. So guys, to be sure that you have um, a, a, a running server, if I click on this uh, button here, can you see that? So you should see a uh, color green that this to tell you that your server is actually uh, running perfectly well you cannot start you know uh, building your applications or you know, texting the the application or software you download it online okay so the purpose of this tutorial is to teach you how to successfully set up this uh software okay so guys uh what i'm gonna do now is um when you click on your browser provided you have installed the server okay if either one server or exam okay just open your browser pipe one two seven dot zero dot zero dot one and you press enter can you see that you should get something like this okay uh this server okay you know comprises a lot of things okay you are gonna see the apache version you are gonna see the php uh, version okay so uh that is not where i'm going i want uh, that's not where i'm going okay so guys the first thing we want to go to database okay and to go to your database put slash okay then you put php my admin okay and uh, you press error okay so once you press error uh you are gonna see something like this actually uh you can access your server by typing local host then you press error can you see that that it display the same thing okay then you can come here and click on this uh a php my admin okay so but uh, in my case i used to access my uh server with uh this ip address one two seven dot zero dot zero dot one okay so we want to create the database i'm going to say uh database and i'm going to say um let's call it template okay i'm going to press error okay so i'm creating the the database okay because this is very important for us okay so you need to create the database and after that and if you have the zip file that you have downloaded uh from either sourceforge or github or, or source code or star or, or from our official website optimum link up okay uh, optimum link up software.com or optimum link up the com engine okay so if you download the zip file from there okay you should you know get um uh something like this can you see that so you should get something like this uh, guys uh, actually you're gonna get the zip file so you are gonna extract the zip file to your server okay uh when you install one server when you go to your addict drive you're gonna see a uh, one server here you're gonna see uh the bw directly click on it okay and uh Actually, this is the zip, code ignara zip, and I've extracted it. So I got this guy here, code ignara template. Okay. Uh, this is the guy. Okay. Or better still, you can just come to this place, uh, click here, and you click on uh, the view, the view directly. Let me click on it. Okay. Can you see that? Uh, you cannot click on this uh, code ignara template or the name you have on your uh, server. Okay. Oh god. So what I want to show you now, the first thing is guys, you have to go to application, uh go to config folder. Uh I want to click on these um a database because we are gonna set a lot of things that okay. Actually, we want to communicate with our database, okay? So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna you know click on the uh, database.php okay so i want to open with dream river okay if you have text editor or uh, or no power plus plus or um, i can't close it let me close that so i want to right click and say open a day with no part plus plus okay so if you have a uh, notepad part or or or, or word path or 
or, or Notepad Plus Plus or Dreamweaver or Visual Studio Code or Sublime Text. Okay, you can just open the file with any of the text literal you have on your on your system. Okay, so guys, I want you to come down here. Okay, ah, the, the, the root is correct. You are gonna get this. You are gonna get the password. Uh, you are gonna get the database. So what I want to do now, I want to say the name of my database is a family okay and i'm gonna save uh, i'm gonna click on this uh, guy here save good because if you go back to your database the name of our database is what a template and that is why we are actually using template here okay so what i'm gonna do next is to uh, close ah uh, close this guy okay so if i come here and say 107 uh put slash then say code ignore template and you know click here good can you see that the template settings does not exist okay it is because we have only created the database there is no uh we don't have the sql file we don't have tables inside the uh the sql uh, i mean inside the database okay so i want to teach you how to get this sql file for this uh template okay so what i'm gonna do now uh guys uh go to the this guy here okay code ignore template the, the the zip file you are going to download from their uh a call a source forge or github or, or source coresta or optimal link engine okay so guys i, I want to go to application okay go to third party good can you see that so go to application go to third uh, party here okay we have this file here okay you are gonna get this that's based uh html is an html uh, file okay so uh click on it okay so once you click on it you are gonna see this link here okay so we have download code ignorer admin template sql file here okay actually we can include the uh, square file inside the for that but we just won't know the number of people that are downloading our a template that are using a template actually nothing more you are free to use the template to build an effect okay so you are free to use it all right so um we just want to track the number of people downloading our template okay so guys you are going to click here once you click here once you click here this uh here okay uh you should see the sql uh file okay so if i click here it should be downloaded to my system okay so what i want to do now um is to go to my downloads okay uh this is my downloads can you see that so we got these uh template file when you download this is exactly what you are gonna get okay you are gonna get exactly something like this so uh, guys open it okay uh, these are the information we have inside this uh, file okay so guys what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna say ctrl a okay or go to your edit okay I uh, can go to edit and say uh, select or okay go back there say uh, copy okay then let's go back to our uh, a database okay just click on this sql file here okay then what you have copied just ctrl v to paste it then i uh, click on this go button here okay so once you click on this go button good okay so it has been successfully created okay these are the the tables inside this uh attempted database what i'm gonna do i want to come back to this guy here and, and refresh let me see what we get can you see that so the page is coming up now so if you follow this tutorial okay you should see something like this okay uh you should see welcome to a code ignorer admin template then click on login button to login actually before you can click on login button you need to supply the email address and the password okay so if i click i want to put something a hey, i want to just put something dot com okay and then put something you click on okay it will not go because we have actually found the wrong email address okay guys i uh, type admin at admin.com and say uh, the password is one two three four now you click on login let me see what we got there <laughs> okay it's coming up oh good can you see that very beautiful thumbprint can you see that so we got these now this is uh, exactly what you are going to get when you follow up this tutorial okay so if you go to uh, uh, uh create user you click on 
new user okay um can you see that so if you want to uh, assign a rules you can say uh new user okay uh you want the user to be able to add to edit and to delete and if it is admin click on this guy here okay admin has everything okay uh this is the way you are going to set the the rule function okay so uh this is the guy here you can have more functions to this uh, uh this information here okay the template is very easy to work with it's very easy to customize and it has a lot of rich uh, features look at, at the or payment let me show you actually this is the template that has been converted to a coding narrow okay uh if you need table you are going to get something like this okay look at the form a lot of things there okay uh if you come back here let me click on widget okay um uh, is coming up can you see that very beautiful we get okay so you can also come to this place uh actually uh i have not written this guy here okay it's not this that's not there i have not read i think rat goes on that okay uh you can also log out just click here to log out and it takes it back to uh, look at it uh, look at the login and log out successfully uh information if i reflect this place you see what i'm saying can you see that log out successfully so the that is how to set up the template so i'm happy because you have downloaded the zip and i want to assure you that no copyright on a template you can use you can use this template for anything so thank you so much guys for watching this video as uh, uh i'll see you in the next upcoming uh videos on free software also thank you so much bye for now